In this video, I bring you a list of five of the most dangerous pastors in the world and their supernatural powers. These so-called men of God display varying degrees of miracles and are so powerful that they have left many doubting their source of power. They have performed uncommon miracles like walking on air, walking on water, healing the sick, raising the dead, turning stone into gold and even talking to God physically over the phone. These pastors have turned stone into bread and even forced their members to eat grass in the name of being the shepherd to his sheep. So today in this video, I bring you a list of five of the most dangerous pastors in the world and their supernatural Natural bizarre powers. Prophet Shepherd Bushiri, also known as Major One, Prophet Shepherd Bushiri is a Malawian Christian pastor, motivational speaker, and businessman. He founded the Enlightened Christian Gathering based in South Africa with headquarters in Pretoria and branches in other African countries and all over the world. And he describes his church as a prophetic ministry based on the principle that God cares and loves people and wants to speak to them directly. Prophet Shepherd Bushiri once shot a video where he was walking on air. This prophet is among the pastors that preach the message of miracle money, where he prays for people and they miraculously have money in their bank accounts. Prophet Bushiri once walked on air in a church service to the astonishment of everyone. The prophet said he walked on air to prove to the world that indeed God is still a God of signs and wonders. Although in a playback of the video, we could easily see strings and ropes attached to the man of God with which he was being held up in the air in what could be seen to be a very poorly performed trick. However, in October 2020, Kama caught up and Shepherd alongside his wife Mary was arrested in South Africa on corruption charges. But after skipping bail and running out of the country, Bushiri was arrested in Malawi in November of the same year or was soon after released you shall chase ten thousand and by that hand you shall chase a million by that hand you shall touch millions by Alpha Lukao. Alpha Lukao is a renowned author and power televangelist with hundreds of thousands of men and women under his leadership. He is a senior pastor and general overseer of Hallelujah Ministries International, which he founded in February 2002 in Johannesburg, South Africa. He also owns a TV channel that broadcasts via satellites all over Africa and Southern Europe. He has about six children and is married to his wife, Celeste Lukao. Alpha Lukao is known for his flamboyant and beautiful display of wealth and affluence on his Instagram page. His pastor wastes no time in displaying his expensive sports cars. Ranging from his Ferraris, Lamborghinis, Rolls Royce, Bugattis, amongst many others. This pastor is also known to perform rare miracles that put him on the map. One of the most controversial ones, however, is a miracle in which he raised a dead man back to life. Although a simple playback of the video shows the alleged dead man blinking and moving his hands even before he was raised. And this pushed many to doubt if the dead man was indeed dead before he was prayed for. The criticism was so much that the South African government decided to investigate the scandal and it was discovered that the whole thing was indeed staged and the dead man was an actor. And even after this, people still flood this church in hundreds of thousands in every service. Paul Sanyagori. Paul Sanyagori is a Zimbabwean religious leader and self-proclaimed prophet. He is the founder of Victory World International Ministries, a church he started in 2014. Paul has been in several controversies because of the bizarre and weird miracles he performs on his church members. Amongst his many miracles include claiming to speak to God directly on phone call in a church service. And by 2017, the pastor was ready to give God's phone number to his church members, claiming that he has the direct contact of heaven, that he talks to God and angels. Unfortunately, the pastor did not keep to his word, claiming that he had no right to to give God's phone number to anyone except himself. Hello? Yes, Father. Is this heaven? Yes, Father. Is it heaven? Yes, Father. I have a woman here. Yes, what do you have to say about her? Prophet Penuel Unguni. This new generation preacher is the founder of End Time Disciples Ministry, although some of you may know him as a snake pastor. This name was given to the pastor after he asked some of his members to eat a live snake. And at one time, he asked his members to eat rats in a church service and told them that as they eat the live rats, all their problems will be gone. This pastor once ordered a woman to sleep inside a deep freezer and left her in for 30 minutes. This pastor is also known for performing other weird miracles in his church service. And by 2017, the pastor visited TB Joshua in the synagogue and was seen confessing that all the miracles he performed in his church were all fake and staged. Yeah. 
Daniel Obinim. This Ghanaian preacher, popularly known as Angel Obinim, is the head pastor of International God's Way Church. In 2016, he told his church that he could transform himself and others into objects and animals. In 2014, Angel was seen on television stepping on a woman's belly in the name of deliverance. And this even led Amnesty International in Ghana to call for his arrest for assault. This pastor once publicly flogged two teenagers, one of whom was pregnant on live television, accusing them of fornication and conspiring to abort a pregnancy. This led to a public outcry and a video soon went viral. Ghana's Minister of Gender, Children and Social Protection, Nana Oye, led a campaign for the preacher's arrest. And after he was arrested, hundreds of his church members led a protest to the police station where they demanded for his release. Captain! Zari! 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 Yes, yeah, so if you've enjoyed this video, hit the like button and I'll see you in the next video.